Well, hello everyone. I'm finally back. Uh, I've been very busy lately. That's the reason I, I didn't upload any videos uh, recently. Uh, I just wanted to thank you for being here and watch this video. Hope it's useful for you. Uh, this is going to be the first video in a series of videos that I'm going to be uploading in the upcoming weeks. Uh, whose purpose is basically to show and teach people about uh, different things uh, about Lightwave 3D, maybe After Effects too. So, uh, okay, let's get down to business. Okay, so uh, let's begin. Uh, we're going to go to a new layer. We're going to go to Setup menu, Genoma presets, and we're going to pick a human biped. Okay. Now that we have the biped, we just have to readjust the scale. So um, the scale is going to be the same as our model. H. And we're just going to position arms, hands, and align everything to the mesh we have. So we're going to um, position this here. Action center selection. And let's move the hand once again. Let's align all the fingers. So I'm just going to align this one and this one. Let's scale it up. Okay. Perfect. Not perfect, but usable. Pretty much done. Uh, let's go check on the legs. So align the feet. The knees seem to be okay from this point of view, but we have to align them on the side. We don't want the, the joints to be outside the mesh. Okay, so we have our basic skeleton already you know, in place. Now our next step will be to create basic weight maps for our character. So let's go to weight shade. And we're going just to do this pretty pretty quick. Oh, let's adjust this and expand the selection new weight map this is going to be our left arm okay now let's go to the other arm let's expand our selection new weight map right arm Okay, very easy. Very, very easy. Let's go to the leg. Oh crap. Okay, let's make sure we have all the polygons we want. And left arm, oh, left arm, left leg. Let's add this polygon 
ones over here on the top. Um, Just uh, we're just missing the head, so let's do this pretty quick. I think it will be easier on the side. What the hell is going on? Okay. basically have all the weight maps we need for our character okay okay now what we need to do is to fade out these weight maps so whenever the character moves and the forms, it's not going to be so harsh on the joints. So let's do that pretty quick. We have to go here to the map section, weight. We're going to use weight blur to pass us. We just want this to be pretty quick. With the right arm, we're going to do exactly the same. Oh, was in the wrong section. Okay. Left leg, weight, blur, two passes, real quick. And left arm, I think, I'm, is the one I'm missing. Blur, two passes, okay. Now we just need to do the same thing for the head. Blur, two passes, okay. So as you can see, Weight blur basically blurs the edge of the weight map. Okay, so now that we have our weight maps ready, we need to make sure that those weight maps are assigned to a specific group of bones. So to do that, we're just going to go into the bone layer. Uh, we're going to select the group of bones. Then we go to the setup menu here, and we're going to go here to the option skeletons and we're going to pick set skeleton weight so this group of bones is going to be assigned with a specific weight map in this case it's going to be the left arm so we're done with this one now we're going to do the same thing set skeleton weight this is going to be the right arm I'm going to select this group of bones here it's going to be the head The left leg now let's do the right leg and we are done don't worry if you pick uh, any of the joints because lightwave only recognizes the bones itself so it's not going to to add any weight into the joints, it's just going to add the weight to the bones. Now the final step will be to put this skeleton in the same layer as the mesh. Let's save this and send it to layout. Okay, so we're here. So we are here in layout. The last step will be to make sure we create the rig, so we go to the setup tab, Genoma, create rig. I will just have to wait a couple of seconds, maybe a minute, and uh, we'll have our rig ready to go. So let's wait for Lightwave to process all the, you know, all the joints, all the bones, all the weight maps. It's calculating everything for you. Let's wait, 
and the genome rig is done how much did that take like two minutes maybe less okay so as you can see lightweight creates a complete set of controllers just for you so let's use this master control and let's make it faces so he's looking at us now and the only thing you have to do now is to animate so let's check this up so the formation is nice it's a bit harsh here but we can work with that, we can live with that very nice very nice and that's it basically we're ready to go see you next time guys